Are we ready to testify together? Yeah. Hallelujah. And this testimony, I like this testimony because last Sunday you said Shem something. You love the healing ministry a lot. And so this testimony is a testimony of healing. Somebody give Jesus praise. Um, um, uh, with me, I have uh, medical tests here that are going to explain to us what was happening to her. And I think I would need help from a medic point of view. Minister Perpetua, maybe you can come and explain to us what is happening here before we just on, put your hands take this uh, testimony. Talking about prolactin here, On parle de la and pro prolactin. her prolactin was very high. What is that? Prolactin is a hormone mm. that is only is, is only meant for when when the when it's supposed to be high when it is breastfeeding mothers because it brings about the milk. Mm. So when it is high in a, in, a, you know, in somebody that is not breastfeeding, it causes problems like hormonal imbalance. And so as we can see here, her prolactin levels was, was very high, almost 1,005. And it is supposed to be 28. No, wait a minute. Yes. 28 to 1,000? Yes. So it was causing her of hormonal imbalance. She could not, she could bleed. She could have a, a series of bleeding all the time. And that made her very anemic. So that uh, she was always on medicine because of anemia. When prolactin levels are high, you only need medicine or surgery for them to go down. But in this case, she did not take any medicine. She did not go through any surgery. But you do not lie, you do not Wait, so you want to tell me, because I think you jumped, so you want to tell me that the things is over? Yes, the prolactin levels are now normal. They are actually 18. That is, that is a normal. You do not lie, you do not fail. What is up for you to do? It doesn't exist, though. It never ever exist, though. Wait, wait. The way we are celebrating, it looks like it is a man who performed this. It is not a man. It is Jesus who has done this. Yes, Papa. According to your knowledge and the way Papa, um, what you say, I feel like the people are not understanding. Pardon? I feel like the people are not understanding what this lady has been going through. Uh -huh. This has been here for eight good years. Eight. She would bleed non-stop until a doctor has to come in to stop it medically. She became anemic. Last month, she was actually on iron drip because there was no... She did not. She was turning white because there was not enough iron in her body because of the bleeding. So I think we do not understand what God has done for her. For eight years, bleeding non-stop. You do not lie, you do not fail. What is up for you to do? It doesn't exist, oh. It can never, ever exist, oh. You do not, you do not lie, you do not fail. What is up for you to do? It doesn't exist, oh. It can never, ever exist, oh. I've seen, I've seen people crying. We should rejoice. Yay! Hallelujah! The Bible days are still alive. Oh, yes. For good eight years. Eight years. While you, you are enjoying your bed, waking up, someone was bleeding for every day. That is uncomfortable. Painful. Depressive. Hey! But in one day, Oh, yes. In one day, oh, yes. Jehovah Rapha has come. Oh, yes. Jehovah Rapha has set her free. Oh, yes. Can I declare over any sickness in this place? It made a mistake to enter in this atmosphere. As long as you are in this atmosphere, I am come. Let the sickness come out. I say, let the sickness come out. Woman, Femme. the same way Jesus said that woman for 12 years, yours is 8 years. To tell you, Jesus loves you. And I declare this shall never, I said never, 
That devil shall never come back again. You are healed forever. You are healed for eternity. And you shall have children. You shall marry well. You shall be established in a good marriage. Many children. Good husband. And be prosperous. In Jesus' precious name. Amen. Congratulations. Congratulations.